Disclaimer. This video has been produced using a copyright free article and is not to be employed as fact or to cause undue stress to anyone but as video entertainment only. The video creator accepts no responsibility for the accuracy of the article and hopes you enjoy the video. This disclaimer is produced by Tony of Tony's Music. Thank you. Agoraphobia, the fear of traveling is the common definition of agoraphobia. This can be a serious condition in which a person isn't able to leave the home at all or it can be a mild disorder in which a person can't travel more than a few hours away from home. When a person attempts to go beyond what is considered their safe boundaries then they go into an agoraphobia panic attack. Starting by taking baby steps is the best way a person can slow their agoraphobia panic attacks. In order to finally master their fears the individual must set specific goals to overcome their panic attacks. Family and friends are the best people to help a person through this process. To the sufferers themselves an agoraphobia panic attack is very frustrating. This is because an agoraphobic attack is often less rational than the typical panic attacks. A fear of public places, especially those where there is a large gathering of people such as a grocery store can develop from a social anxiety. An individual who suffers from general panic disorders can become embarrassed of their disorder, which can then cause a fear of traveling and suffering a panic attack in public. The only way for a person to overcome these attacks is to push their limits, which makes treatment of agoraphobia panic attack difficult. Before getting better many agoraphobics tend to get worse for this reason. Since all an individual has to do is stay within their safe zone they tend to ignore their agoraphobic problem. However, while the problem can be easy to ignore it is a stifling symptom that comes from a chronic panic disorder. Little by little, agoraphobia can be overcome. It takes time and a lot of patience. This is one time the person with this disorder must learn to turn to someone trusted to help them through.